Good morning. My name is Ralph Bredukes. I am an author and addiction recovery coach, a life coach, and the host of this show to take your life back today radio show. You can also see a video of this on a channel, Take Your Life Back Today show on YouTube. Folks, it's early in the morning. Starting today, I'll be sharing a morning wake-up video relating to different things such as love, hope, faith, empathy, compassion, uh, fellowship, and many more for the next eight days. Please tune in daily uh, for the next eight shows to hear my message to kickstart your day. You may have big problems today, but we serve a bigger God. Quit worrying. Uh, God is saying all is well. Don't let a temporary period of being uncomfortable keep you from uh, permanent blessings. Yes, it takes discipline. Yes, it's uncomfortable, but your destiny is at stake. God is going to put you in the right place at the right time. He's going to send you divine connections, people that will go out of their way to God to be good to you. You could make it happen. It's a favor of God bringing you into your yes world. You must make a decision that uh, you are going to move on. It won't happen automatically. You have to rise up and say, I don't care how hard this is. I don't care how disappointed I am. I'm not going to let this that get the best of me. I'm moving on with my life. God is going to put you at the right place at the right time with hope. He's going to send divine connections, people that will go out of their way to be good to you each and every day. Of course you couldn't make it. It's the favor of God bringing you into your yes world. God is directing your steps. Trust Him when you don't understand. Trust Him when it feels like you're going to the wrong way. The Most High God is ruling in your favor starting today with hope. He's going to rescue you from the deep waters of despair and uncomfortable. He is going to deliver you from powerful enemies. When Jesus hung on the cross, he took all your mistakes, all your failures, all your weaknesses, and forgave them. Quit worrying about what everybody thinks. When you come to the end of life, you're not going to stand before people and give an account of your life. You are going to stand before the Almighty God. Your job is not your source. God is your source. He's li not limited by your salary, but by your training, by your connections. He has ways to bless you that you've never thought of. Don't complain about who did wrong and how uh, unfair it was. If it were uh, going to keep you from your destiny, God would not have permitted it. Shake it off and get ready for the new doors to open. There is hope for new opportunities. Things are about to turn in your favor. You're going to defy the odds through the power of Christ. People are going to know that the Lord is on your side. If somebody left you, you have to realize their part in your story is over. If they walked away, then you don't need them. If God allowed it, that means they are not part of your destiny. Quit beating yourself up because you're not where you uh, thought you'd be in life right now. Friends, you're not a finished product. God is still working on you this morning. God is not going to stop every difficulty, every bad break, but he will give you the strength, the power, the grace to go through each and every one of those He's going to supply all the hope. Call me at 844-405-HELP. Together, you and I, we can help each other, take our lives back, be good to yourselves, and always be good to each other. And remember, a simple smile to the total stranger will help that stranger for the rest of their life and yours. Tune in for the next seven shows. But today was about hope, and God is supplying you with hope. May God bless you, and we'll talk to you guys real soon. Take good care of yourselves, and God bless you. Take care.